Item number SCP-1735. Index, kind of impenetrable barrier. Object class, safe. Special containment procedures. SCP-1735 has been marked with 70 millimeter lines of industrial paint on its meridian, zenith, and nadir to indicate its position. The area surrounding the beach is maintained with an electrical fence and a staff of two guards. The area is to be surveyed at all times. At no time is the object to be marked again, as current markings have been found to be intangible. Description SCP-1735 is a static, immovable, invisible barrier surrounding a plastic grocery bag on a beach. Point zero 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 degrees north. Point zero 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 degrees west. In Newfoundland, the barrier is spherical and extends 0 0.70 meters in all directions around the bag. All methods undertaken to penetrate SCP-1735 have proven unsuccessful. Further attempts to remove the bag from inside of the barrier are underway. Excavation of SCP-1735 caused sand located within the barrier to fall out of the bottom, completely emptying the contents of the barrier save for the grocery bag located within. Attempts to replace the sand into SCP-1735 have been unsuccessful. The bag located within is currently floating as if affected by light wind currents of varying directions in a persistent manner. The bag appears to approach the edge of SCP-1735 at times, but never seems to exit. SCP-1735 was discovered during a forensic investigation undertaken by local police after a dirt bike fatality in 2004. Citizens involved with the investigation were issued Class A amnestics. Further investigation has revealed multiple cases of fatalities in the area presumed to have been caused by collisions with SCP-1735. Dating back to 03-12-1823. Several accounts of capsized fishing vessels have also been reported dating back to as far as 1738. No reports indicating an anomaly have been found until the incident in 2004. It is not known whether the grocery bag has always been present within SCP-1735. Addendum. The perimeter of the SCP-1735 containment area was breached by an additional grocery bag on 01-27-2010. This new grocery bag entered SCP-1735 aided by wind current, without any additional effort. The bag is currently located within the barrier along with the current grocery bag. Attempts to replicate the conditions by which the grocery bag entered SCP-1735 have been unsuccessful. Investigation into the origin of this grocery bag is underway.